morning YouTube it's Saturday morning September 29th you can see where we're at we're inside the Torino she's purring right away there is a, a big rod run that comes here every year this weekend so I thought I was going to be working on a truck and somebody kind of reminded me of the Air Force Park rod run in Louisville Kentucky so we're going to head to that it's kind of early not too I should have gotten started earlier the gates open at 8 and it costs some money to get in so hopefully it won't be so packed that we can't get in it and uh, it's a huge rod run and now we got this thing running cool in traffic we can actually enjoy it in this car so we're gonna head out I really need a left-handed camera to drive to drive and video actually I never have hooked up something Oop, I'm off the road here we off-roading in the 68 but uh, I never have hooked up anything for the tripod in here where I can um, make some decent driving videos but yeah we're gonna you know I, I would love I really do need to get back on that truck but hey summer's almost over uh, the weather's nice let's enjoy the beginning of fall here and the fall time is my favorite time of year just go walk around look at some hot rides I'm going to try to film while I cruise through which it's gonna be hard to do. It's really crowded in there and you gotta watch what you're doing. You don't want to scrape anybody's car or hurt your own. So, um, yeah, we headed to town and going to the right one. Alright, we're just sitting in the gas station, just got done filling it up. Just want to show you something, that how this thing is working so much better. It used to be, if I drove this for a little bit and parked it and filled it up with gas, of course your engine heats up when you turn everything off. It's up to 200 right now. And uh, not only was I having cooling problems in the traffic while it was running, but uh, I had hot start problems. If this engine had a little bit of heat in it, it would not start. Here's what this battery did for me. Yeah, I know, that's where they're all supposed to start, but after all the troubles I had, <laughs> that is so nice. And to hell yeah. Alright, let's go to the cruise. Alright, we're cruising through the woods of Iroquois Park. We finally followed the signs and found what's supposed to be the entrance. Show cars are supposed to go down this road. So we'll see if they'll let us pay and get in here. I don't know how far, but anyway, this is here's a nice view of Iroquois Park. Kind of like Central Park in New York, I guess. But, yeah. We got some decent stuff in Louisville. Not a lot, but some decent stuff. Okay, I'm going to leave the camera off till I pay and get in. I don't want to screw up and hit anybody. I need to pay attention to my driving. Alright, we're... We're in, very crowded. You gotta find a place to park, get your sticker. So, yeah, we're gonna cruise for a little ways. I'm not 100% sure where to get my sticker at. Show you a little view of what it's like in here. looking falcon there like those little cars Ooh, 63 wagon fair lane all right just want to brag on my cooling system we still slowly looking for a parking spot temperature it is real nice just to ride in this car and cruise through and look at everything. Glad I decided to come here today. This is a big show. I'm going to be here a while today. Probably won't get no work done, but so what? Alright, we finally found a parking spot. There she sits right there. Got to go all the way to the end. You got to get here early for this ride run. It's 
getting bigger every year. Hard to find a parking spot, but I do like the shade. Nice looking 55 Ford wagon. Got a looks like a small block in it, 351 base block, Windsor. The car's put together pretty nicely, really. Check out that flip top front end. Somebody got creative there. It looks like it's done the way I would do it, homemade. That's the only way to do it. Do it the way you want it done. And it's cheaper. I like the old dashes on these old cars too. I want something like this to work on one day. Looks like a beautifully restored 346 pack car. It's getting close to the where the gate's going to be closed, and I'm going to cruise through this thing one more time. Just set the camera on the dash and let you take a look at everything.
say, that's the whole cruise strip for the Iroquois Park Ride Run from the beginning to the end. You gotta have a really good cooling system on there and then the fans just kicked off after all that. It's not a super hot day, it's, it's in the 80s. It's not cool, cool either. So, that's all for this video. Hope you like the Iroquois Park Ride Run in Louisville, Kentucky. Uh, happens at the end of September every year. If you like what you saw, want to come up and see it, come on up to Louisville, Kentucky next year. Thanks for watching.